This matter was brought to the attention of the law enforcement authorities in 1992 or 93, 92 I believe and it was fully investigated. It was a six month investigation by the Yale New Haven Sex Abuse Clinic which is a nationally recognized group that decides uh, for prosecutors offices whether the case exists or doesn't exist. They determined that there was no case, no, mol no molestation period and that was the end of the case and uh, it cannot be brought up at this point again. My point out, I think Mr. Allen is, is at this point extremely upset about uh, the whole matter because he's sure and I agree with him that Dylan absolutely believes that this happened uh, because if, you're, if a memory is implanted in you when you're fragile and cannot distinguish between fantasy and reality, that sticks with you the rest of your life. So it's, it's sad and it's uh, unfortunate uh, that she was used as a pawn in a fight between uh, Mia and Woody. Uh, she was used as a pawn when she was seven years old and she's being used as a pawn in my view now at 28. The legal case, there is no legal case, it's over. Um, the fact that Dylan is free in this country to say whatever she wants, uh, uh, nobody's going to be able to stop her and we can't stop people from believing what they want to believe. The fact of the matter is that she got, uh, and Mia Farrow got, the best process that you could ask for when you have an allegation of child abuse. She went to the authorities, the authorities treated it seriously, they retained as an expert group the best group in the country to make a determination. They determined that the molestation did not occur. That is the end of the case. There is no case. People can continue to talk about it and it can be headlines in the tabloids, but the fact of the matter is there is no case and there was no case. In the Vanity Fair article, Mia suggested that Ronan may have been fathered by Frank Sinatra. Um, does Woody have anything to say about that? I haven't discussed that with him um, at all. So, um, And also I must say that that did not come up at all at the time of the custody uh, battle and it would seem to me that if Woody was seeking custody of Ronan at that point, uh, if uh, Mia Farrow was opposing it, if she could have demonstrated that Ronan was not his son, she would have done that at that point. The fact that she didn't do it then uh, leads me to believe that it's just another uh, wild accusation by Mia Farrow.